I'm Ethan Moore from Stockroom Supply, and I got an email from Greg, who bought a Flymaster, or he bought a Flymaster, he hasn't received it yet, but he's just planning on how he's going to set it up in his shop, and he's concerned about the height, how high he should have the table set up um, compared to other tools in the shop. So a couple things. Um, one, uh, oftentimes what people will do is they will set the Flymasters up in the oak feed of their table saws. Very, very common thing for people to do. A, a table saw is relatively low, it's about 34 inches tall, which for a lot of people is, is fairly comfortable to use with a flat master. Now, I personally like it just a little bit higher. So right now, this guy here, I have it set at 39 inches tall, which is a little bit closer to, I guess, a bandsaw height. Um, I just find it comfortable there. I'm not in a super tall person. I'm, I'm 5'8", um, so really depending on how tall you are will determine how tall you may want to sit your flat master. There's no right or wrong answer, I guess is what I'm saying. So, um, but another thing I'll mention is uh, regarding the legs or a cabinet, you can sit it on top of a bench, that's no problem but I have it right now on top of a universal lathe stand. This is one that Rikon has made, but a lot of companies make nearly the identical stand. Um, we've made the Flatmaster so that it will bolt up right to the top of that stand. So they're very nice, heavy duty stands. If you want to have your Flatmaster freestanding, like I have it right here. And the beauty of them is they're totally adjustable. So you could lower that right down or you can raise that right up depending what's comfortable for you. So yeah, no right or wrong answer. I have mine set at 39 inches. I lick a little bit higher than a lot of people, a lot of folks, so right in the yoke feet of their table saw. So yeah, if anybody else has any questions, you can email me at info at stockroomsupply.com or just comment in the video. Now, if you wanna see future videos, make sure you subscribe and hit the little bell button. Thank you much.